Invitational Tournament here at Powell Valley High School. I'm P.J. Grinsell with Mike Van Winkle on camera, and we're set for basketball action. The game tonight will, will be featuring Gate City High School Blue Devils against the Volunteer Falcons in the second game of the tournament. In the first game, we saw Powell Valley overcoming uh, Hurley by a rather large margin. So we should be set for a good game. Gate City coming out of the AA rankings in Virginia, going up against Volunteer out of the AAA rankings in Tennessee. Should be an excellent matchup between two run and gun teams. It'll be interesting to see how Volunteer can stop Chris Shelton and Kevin Morris at the same time. And Volunteer with a good sized average on their team, around 6-1. And Gage City, of course, with Shelton in the middle, six, eight and a half, listening in the program, and Morris from the outside can hit the long bombs. We're going to get the starting lineups for you in just a moment. Going down the roster for Gage City, we have Kevin Morris, Arthur Ferguson, Chris Shelton, Rusty Pendleton, Jason Hensley, Josh Collins, Kelly Spivey, Kevin Williams, Brian McDavid, Tony Bellamy, Chris Potts, Steve Reed, and Gary Watts. Down the lineup for Volunteer, you have Shane Byington, Chris Alley, Chuck McLean, Joe Duthat, Andy Watterson, Greg Hill, Chris Crowder, Jason Carter, Mike Burnett, Joey Fleener, Mark Price, and Mitch Bellamy. And now we'll have the starting lineups for the Volunteer Falcons. For the Volunteer Falcons, starting the guard, number 20, Joe Calvin. At guard, number 20, and they do not have him listed in the program. Number 42, Chris Alley, will be starting a guard. At center will be number 32, Shane Byington. Number 30, Chuck McLean, will be forward. And at the other forward will be Chris Crowder, number 24. And now you're going to hear the starting lineups of the Big Blue Devils, coached by Dave Mason. Number 12, Arthur Ferguson at guard. At the other guard, number 32, Jason Hensley. Jason Hensley at another guard, number 32. Center, number 54, Chris Shelton. Chris, the animal Shelton, the center, number 54, the postman for Gate City. Number 50, Rusty Pendleton, a forward. Gate City has to rely heavily on him tonight. And Kevin Moose Morris will round out the starting lineup, number 24 at guard. As Gage City breaks down the team and the center of court, we'll be set for basketball action in just a moment. And a reminder, the winner of this game will go on to face John I. Burton Friday, December the 11th here at Powell Valley. Powell Valley has advanced to face Hayside. And Saturday, December 12th, will be the Losers Brackets and the Championship game. So we encourage you to come out and support the Big Blue in their effort to capture the post-Tiger market crown. And we're set for action. Number 54, Chris Shelton will be the jump, do the jumping chores for Gate City. He'll be going up against number 32, Shane Bynes, in a volunteer. It's up and controlled by Gate City. Hensley comes down with it. Volunteer going to go into a man-to-man -man defense. Over to Ferguson. Ferguson going to drive. Takes a shot up. It is good. Arthur Ferguson for two for Gate City. Now Gate City putting pressure on up court, nearly stolen away, quick pass up court, number 32, Byington wide open over Shelton, good, score not at two, game has just started. Ferguson quickly into Hensley, Hensley motions the placers down the court, Ferguson quick pass up to Morris, Morris had control, shoots it, is no good, rebound by number 20 for Volunteer. That is Duthot, he will have the ball handling towards for Volunteer, Gate City also playing a man-to-man -man defense. Shelton just daring Byington to take it from out there. Now to Duthot. Duthot being guarded by Hensley. Going to drive. This is off to Byington. Going to be a traveling violation called on Duthot. Drag the foot before you get the pass off. Be a turnover to Gate City. Score not at a two as Gate City will be having the possession, bringing it up court this time. Hensley long pass up to Pendleton in the corner, far side. Back to Hensley. Hensley love inside to Shelton. Shelton, oh, miss. Shelton shot up good. Shelton puts the shot up over number 24 for Volunteer. It is good. Gate City up 4-2 to two now. Pressure up court, tipped away. It is off of Rusty Pendleton as number 30 for Volunteer. McLean grabbed it and banged it off Pendleton's leg. Good move by number 30, McLean. 
Volunteer doing the inbounding now. Long pass to number 24. Back to number 20, Duthot. Duthot sets up his offense now. Very patient. Sign of a good point guard. Going to move to the near side. Inside to number 30. He has nowhere to go with Shelton. Back to number 24. Good defense by Hensley. Back to Ferguson. Again, Duthot sets up a new offense. Goes over to the far corner. And knocked out of bounds by Hensley. It'll be volunteer ball out of bounds on the side, or excuse me, on the front. 6.17 left to play in this first period of action we just started. Gate City with a 4-2 lead. Out to Duthot. Duthot going to drive it around. Out to number 42. Long jumper is no good. And there is Pendleton with the rebound. And loses it, but he's going to dish it off to Ferguson. Arthur Ferguson brings it up court, passes the half court line, and hands off to Morris. Morris going to set the O up for Gate City. As he's going to drive, go in, puts the shovel shot up, and good. Devin Morris puts Gate City up 6-2 now. Again, Gate City with a light pressure up court. Volunteer having long passes up to Byington. Byington, his shot up, and good. The foul also. So Byington can go to the line to complete the three. Foul going to be on number 50, Rusty Pendleton, as he hit Byington's arm as he went up for the shot. Byington will be at the line shooting one to complete the three-point play. Volunteer has pulled within two, six to four the score. Byington shot up and good. Strips the nets and Volunteer has come back to within one. Hensley, long pass over to Morris. Morris at the three, going to take it on in. Fakes going to go up with the shot, is no good off the backboard. Rebound Shelton. Shelton goes up with it. No, and they're going to say he traveled with it. Chris Shelton whistled for the traveling violation before the shot, and it'll be Volunteer ball out of bounds. Volunteer passing around now. Over to number 20, Duthot. Again, he's double teamed by Ferguson and Hensley. Quickly passed off to number 42. He gets it up. Met by Shelton. Going to pass it back out. And Duthot going to set up his offense now. On the near side of the court. Passed over to number 42. Inside to Byington. Back out to Duthot. Number 24. Long jumper. No good. And there is going to be off of a volunteer player. Number 42. Not listed on the program as he and Morris struggled for it. Hensley will inbound it for Gate City. 5.09 left to play here in the first period of action at Powell Valley High School. Long pass of court to Shelton to Pendleton. Back to Hensley as he gives the fifth sign of the offense. Going to set things up for Morris. Morris being guarded by Duthot. Going to drive on Duthot. Loses control of it. Regains it. Now going to turn back. Kicks it over to Hensley in the corner. Hensley for three. Let's see. Good. Jason Hensley hits the home run shot and puts Gate City up by four. Nine to five. And again, Gate City pressure up court. Duthot cross pass number 42. He's met by Hensley. Going to pull it back. And nearly stolen. Hensley picks his pocket. But they're going to say Hensley turns the ball over. Going to call palming on Jason Hensley as he dribbles along the far side of the court. Turn over to Volunteer at about half court line. 4.30 left to play here in the first quarter of action. Inbound to number 42. Back to Duthot. Duthot has shown signs of a good point guard tonight. Excellent. Good patience with his offense. Ferguson giving number 24 all kind of trouble in the corner. Out to number 42. His jumper from 18. Good. And quickly, Gate City moves the ball court. Long pass to Morris. Morris. And oh, good defense. And now Morris caught the ball on the baseline. Be out of bounds to volunteer. Great defense that time by number 32, Shane Byington, a six foot two senior, the center for the team, as he batted the ball away. Now volunteer pushing it up court quickly. Byington, Byington, good pass, but knocked away by Ferguson. Good defense. He was intending the pass for number 30, Chuck McLean. Nine to seven, the score. Gates in the lead. Volunteer inbounding now to finally inside to Byington. Byington kicks it out. His shot no good. And number 32, Byington gets the rebound, puts it in over Shelton. Byington has done a good job outmanning Shelton underneath tonight. Chris Shelton going to have to play a good game. Gates City's going to succeed. Again, now Volunteer, applying pressure. Long pass to Morris. That's twice in a row. Morris for three. It is no good. Yes, they're going to save for three. Kevin Morris sticks the long-range jumper. Gates City up by three. Duthot goes around Ferguson quickly. And Gates City back on defense. Volunteer going to have to pull it out. Duthot looks it over, yells at his signals. 
Morris pounding him. Out to number 42, looks inside, trying to get Byington. Gives it to number 30, McLean. McLean gonna drive, Byington open, he puts the shot out good. Fake Shelton now, Shelton went for McLean. A good pass to Byington. Volunteer, now playing again in a man-to-man -man defense. Been working effectively for them tonight. Hensley, catches over to Morris. Morris at the three-point line, gonna dribble, gonna take it inside, his shot up, and no good. But there will be a foul. Going to call a charging foul. Oh, my, on Kevin Morris. It'll be his first foul as he and Duthot hit the floor rather hard. First foul on Morris, second team foul on Gate City. Now Duthot leaving his way through the press of Gate City. Gets it up to number 24. His shot up and good. So number 24 for Volunteer, it's a long range shot and they are, they, they have jumped into the lead 13 to 12. Now Hensley gonna drive, kicks it into Pendleton. Pendleton gonna go up, his shot, good. Rusty Pendleton used his body effectively that time to maneuver in and get the basket. 2-16 left to play here in the first quarter of action. Gate City and Volunteer. Duthot over to Byington, back out to number 30, McLean. And Duthot now gonna set the offense up. Looking inside, trying to work Byington open. He's not going to take it. Pass over to number 24. He's being guarded by Ferguson. Into Byington. Byington trying to get around Shelton. Loses it off of Shelton's foot, they're going to say. It could be volunteer ball out of bounds. Underneath the Gate City goal. Number 42 do the inbounding chores for volunteer. Now out to... You thought. Now 42 going to pop the long one. Good. You cannot leave these volunteer players open. They're going to burn you long. Quick pass up court to Hensley. Hensley, good move. Shut up and good. Great passing by the Gage City offense that time. Gage City back into the lead now. 16 to 15. A fast paced first quarter. You thought. Barely gets it over the timeline. Now he's going to drive. Going to work his way back out and set his offense up. Ferguson using the body on him a little bit. Out to number 42. Trying to work it inside to their big men. Gets to Byington. Byington over Shelton. Good. Byington, little hook shot. Was able to get up and over an off-balance Shelton for two more as Volunteer goes into the lead in a seesaw battle. And into Shelton. Shelton's lob is good. Rolls it in. Now Gate City back in. Chris Shelton opening up the lane a little bit. And Gate City putting pressure now on Volunteer. 42 being double teamed by Morrison Ferguson. Into number 30, McLean. McLean wide open. Hits it. Under a minute left. 50 seconds. Clock winding down. Over to Ferguson. Ferguson's jumper good. Arthur Ferguson strips the nets. As Gate City has moved back into the lead by 1. 20 to 19 to score. To McLean. McLean gets tensely up in the air. Going to take it on the dribble. Comes to the far side. Over number 42. Wide open. His jumper good. Number 42, a volunteer, has done an excellent job. Referee calls the timeout to allow a volunteer player to retie a shoe. 30 seconds left to play here in the first quarter of action. Volunteer is leading Gate City 21-20 in a seesaw battle here at Powell Valley Gymnasium in the post-Tiger Market Invitational. Lob inside of Shelton, and Shelton just cannot get a handle on it as he sends number 30 McLean to the floor. No whistle. But Gate City still trying to work that ball into Shelton, trying to get him active in their offense. Across the timeline, Volunteer comes, pulls it back out. Byington going to give it to number 20, Two Thoughts. 24, jumper, good. Volunteer has been superb from the outside. Hensley's long jumper at the buzzer, no. Going to be a whistle. And let's see, they're going to call a... Going to say Hensley stepped on the baseline on the far side. The volunteer will get the ball with one second left. And you, you know if you're Gate City, you're going to have to be very aware of the three-point shot. Number 24, his shot up and no good. So at the end of one quarter of action, Volunteer is leading Gate City by a score of 23 to 20. We'll break for a moment and be back with you in just a minute. Shane Byington, the center for Volunteer, doing an excellent job of neutralizing number 54, Chris Shelton, for Gate City. Shelton just could not work free underneath. Thus, Volunteer has worked their game plan out well, and Moose Morris has been, has just not, has been a, uh, had an off night. He's hit a couple of shots, but it's not a typical Morris night. As quickly, referee gets it down, and he started counting. Volunteer hurries out onto the court. 
Volunteer number now number 10 into the game for Volunteer. That is Jason Carter. Inside to number 44 as he maneuvers around Shelton. His shot no good. Shelton with a rebound. Off to Morris. Morris pushing it up quickly for Gate City. Gonna hold it down. Being guarded by number 12. That is Mitch Bellamy. Off to Jason Hensley. Hensley the point guard for Gage City. Gonna set up the offense. Over to Morris. Morris turn around jumper. Beautiful. From about 19, Kevin Morris, turnaround jumper, good. Brings Gate City within one, 23-22. Now number 10, Carter, for Volunteer on the near uh, court. And Bellamy, Tony Bellamy, who has checked in the game now. Number 40, good job. Three-pointer, no good. Morris with the rebound. Kicks it up to Bellamy quickly. Bellamy up to Pendleton. Pendleton shot up and good. Good execution by Gate City that time. Moving the ball court well. Number 40, Tony Bellamy. The super six-man off the bench has come into the game, replacing Ferguson. As Coach Day Mason perhaps want to get a little physical in there. And pass inside to Byington. Byington on the baseline, wide open, hits the shot. The ball's there up now, 25-24. Bellamy in the corner, being handed by number 44, Ant Watterson. Knocked out of bounds, and they're going to say off Hensley. It'll be volunteer ball. Going up the line of changes. Watterson has come in, as has Carter, and number 12, Bellamy, for volunteer. And Byington and number 30, McLean, have stayed in. Bellamy, the only change for Gate City. Over to McLean, inside to Watterson. Watterson's shot rejected by Shelton. Morris holds up and gives to Hensley. Hensley being guarded by Carter. Good defense by Carter. Hensley maneuvers around him, and he'll set things up for the Mighty Blue Devils now. Hensley looking inside, has Bellamy. Bellamy's turnaround jumper, no good. There's Shelton for the rebound. He goes up with a shot, good. Chris Shelton back in cleaning the boards. Gives Gate City a 26-25 lead with six minutes left to play before the halftime. And quickly, number 10, Jason Carter calls timeout. And with that timeout, we'll break from action with a score, 26-25, Gate City in the lead. Cal Valley will face Hayside December the 11th, tomorrow night. As the teams take the floor, the winner of tonight's game will face John I. Burton, and the losers of tonight's games will play again on Saturday, as will the championship game be played also. Back to action. Volunteer inbounding the ball at half court to Watterson. Back to Byington, and now Carter going to set the offense up for Volunteer, being guarded by Hensley. Volunteer coach going to his bench as Bellamy, good defense, and they're going to call a foul on Tony Bellamy as he knocks it out of bounds. It'll be the first foul on Bellamy, third team foul. Volunteer has no team fouls as of yet. And this one will just be a possession out of bounds. McLean inbounding it to Carter. Back to McLean. McLean driving on the baseline. He is open. No good. For the rebound is Morris. Morris in traffic. Pulls up. Kicks it out to Hensley. Hensley patiently brings it across half court. Looks through it now, looks through his last spins. Over to Morris. Morris has it stripped away by number 12, Bellamy. Bellamy gonna go all the way as Hensley wisely let him go in. And Volunteer regains the lead, 27-26. Good defense by Mitch Bellamy on that stolen pass. Hensley almost stolen. Morris recovers back to Hensley. Hensley gonna set things up for Morris. Morris gonna have the ball handling towards now. Spins around two defenders. And they're gonna say Morris palm the ball. That's two. Palming violations of Gate City team players tonight. So with 5.07 left to play before half, Volunteer inbounding the ball now. Number 10, Jason Carter, the point guard, over to McLean in the corner. McLean about the three-point line, being guarded by Bellamy. Looks, kicks it out to Bellamy for a volunteer. And inside, Watterson's open over Shelton. Shelton may have blocked it. Hensley has a rebound, bringing down a four-on-three break. Hensley from the foul line, too hard. And Shelton tips it up, but they're going to call a foul on Shelton over the back. Just came charging in. And that will be the, let's see, how many fouls on Shelton. That'll be the first foul on Chris Shelton. Gate City now with four fouls. 439 left to play. Fox winding down. Volunteer very patient with its offense, working for a good shot. Whereas Gate City with the run and gun type offense. Now Gate City going into what appears to be a zone. One, two, two zone. As Morris nearly still at Carter over Shelton. His shot no good. Pendleton with the rebound. Kicks it out to Morris. Got a two-on-one with Bellamy. Kicks it over to Bellamy. Bellamy goes in for the layup. Good. 
Number 40, Tony Valmy. Bulls Gate City ahead by one, 28-27. Carter looks to his bench to get instructions from the coach as he again patiently brings it across half-court line. Over to Bellamy for a volunteer, Mitch Bellamy. Nearly stolen by Morris. Carter kicks it over to Byington. Byington's shot rolls in, and we are going back and forth on this seesaw battle. Morris now picking it up for, kicks it to Hensley. Hensley's long jumper, boom, as he brings Gate City now. Ahead by one, 341 left to play before halftime. Excellent ball game you're being treated to between these two fine teams, Gate City and Volunteer. Carter has it stripped away to Byington's hands over Shelton. It's no good. And Hensley comes down with it as he's bringing up court to Bellamy. Tony Bellamy from Gate City pulls up. His shot may have been deflected. Byington with a rebound volunteer. Kicks it up to Jason Carter. Carter over Hensley. His shot up and good. Volunteer now in the lead by one. 31-30. Hensley has it stripped away, but a foul is called on number 10, Jason Carter. That'll be the first team foul and volunteer and first foul on Carter. Volunteer, very disciplined, very disciplined team. Not many turnovers and not many fouls. Inbound to Pendleton and he'll hand off to Hensley. Hensley now gonna drive it. Pull up at the three-pointer line, gonna drive in. Kick it inside to Shelton. Shelton shot is no good, but they're gonna call a traveling. Look at it, three seconds, but they gonna change it to a traveling violation on Shelton. Gate City just having a hard time getting it started in the middle tonight. And now with two under three minutes, 2.55 left to play. Volunteer up by one, looking to go up by three. Maybe four. <laughs> Off to Mitch Bellamy. Mitch Bellamy going to drive, pull up at the foul line. Good. Mitch Bellamy has played outstanding basketball for Volunteer as he has put them ahead by three. Gate City behind Jason Hensley, trying to rally now. Over to Bellamy in the corner. Lob into Shelton. Shelton has it. And they're going to call a traveling violation on Shelton. Gate City's fans very unhappy with that call. Thought maybe it should have been a foul. As into the game comes number 12, Arthur Ferguson for Gate City. Going to replace Hensley. Number 42 for Volunteer checks in, replacing number 44, Watterson. And number... 24 for Volunteer Crowder comes in. And now I think they have things straight as Stan Hensley finally goes to the bench. 2.31 before the halftime. We are here at Powell Valley Gymnasium, 33 to 30. Volunteer leading over Gate City. As now the penalty, Bellamy brings it up to McLean. McLean going to pull up over Shelton. Shelton blocks it. Pendleton to the rebound out to Morris. Morris bringing it up for Gate City. Going to pull up as he lost control. Bam, then a sweaty palm. And now Carter going to drive up two on two as he wisely pulls up as Pendleton was in his way. Jason Carter now going to set it up as Ferguson. Good pressure. Carter going to drive in and stone away. Pendleton picks it up out to Bellamy. Bellamy with a three on two break to Morris. Morris is foul. He is shot up and good. Kevin Moose Morris brings out the resume tags in the Blue Devil offense as he will be going for the three point play. 157 left and count the basket. 157 left before the halftime. Gate City now within one. 32 33 the score. That'll be the second team foul on Volunteer. We'll put Morris at the line, shooting one shot. Outstanding ball game thus far between two very talented teams, Gate City and Volunteer, as Morris will prepare to shoot his foul shot. It's up and no good. Rebound McLean for Volunteer. Uncharacteristic of Morris. So Gate City finds itself down by one. 150 as Volunteer with the ball. Mitz Bellamy. On the near side, going to drive it, pulls up. No, going to kick it off to McLean inside. He is fouled by Pendleton. Shot will not count, I don't believe. Let's see. No. Pushing foul, two shot on Pendleton. And that will be his first foul on number 50, Rusty Pendleton. Gate City with five fouls now. They are over the limit. Now on every foul, non-shooting will be a one and one. McLean's first shot up and good. Gives Volunteer a two-point lead, 
Volunteer, very disciplined team, and have worked on the fundamentals, and they are very good all around. McLean, second shot, good. Volunteer up by three now. Gate City quickly working it up. Morris going to drive for Gate City. His takes it in. Finger roll, good. Gate City pulls it in and one. Ferguson putting pressure on number 20. Do thought. Do that, excuse me. To Mitch Bellamy. Mitch Bellamy setting it up for a volunteer. Gives to number 24. That's to do that. He's going to drive it, and he pulls out. Volunteer playing a little clock game with Gate City. The old Dean Smith type four corners. And Duthat kicked it inside to McLean. Stolen away by Shelton to Ferguson. Quickly at the Pendleton. Pendleton regains control. He's going to drive in. His shot is no good. There's Bellamy with a tip in. Tony Bellamy comes flying from nowhere to put the tip in. And Gage City has gone up by one, 36-35. Duthat being hounded by Ferguson. As he's going to drive in, kicks it off. Shelton blocks the shot. Chris the Animal Shelton says, no way. Quickly up court, Morris. Morris going to drive up to Bellamy. Bellamy shot, good. Gates City on a run now. The fans for Gates City have come to life. 38-35 the score, and we are now to 30 seconds left before the half. Bellamy being hounded as he gives to number 24. He's going to drive it, gives out, and back to Dutat. Ball's here working for the last shot, it looks like. 17 seconds, going to drive in. Let's see, going to foul, going to be called on Bellamy. Before the shot, it will be a... Let's see what the foul call is. It should be a one and one. At the line will be number 20, Joe Duthat, a six foot one senior point guard for Volunteer. He'll have a one and one. His first shot, no good. Shelton with the rebound. Gate City with 10 seconds to work with now as Ferguson pushes up court over to Morris. Morris with nine as he is handled by two players. And at the hurry, six. Morris into Bellamy. Bellamy shot up and good. Morris threads the needle. Two seconds, one second. Shot up, hits the Raptors. It is no good. So at halftime, Gage City has jumped out to a five-point lead, 40 to 35 over Volunteer. We'll break from the action for just a moment, reminding you you're watching Scott County Cable Vision Channel 30. Gage City of the AA Highlands District of Virginia and Volunteer of the Big Ten Conference in the AAA of Tennessee. Uh, rankings has been a good game thus far. Volunteer has done an excellent job with the defense of Chris Shelton inside and also with their outside shooting. And uh, Gate City has gotten, of course, their usual surge with six man Tony Bellamy coming off the bench and Kevin Morris also having a good game. Chris Shelton has come on as of late in the came on late in the first half and we're back to action. Excuse me as. Hensley for Gate City will be the point guard now, going up against number 20, Two Thought. Over to Pendleton. Pendleton kicks it out to Ferguson. Ferguson to Hensley. Hensley at the three-point line on the far side. Looks inside. Finds Morris. Morris going to drive inside. Put the shot up. It is good. Rolls good. Kevin Morris, two more for Gate City as they jump out to a seven-point lead, 42-35. We're just underway here. And the third quarter of action. Over to number 24 in the corner, being guarded by Ferguson. Kicks it out to number 42, being guarded by Morris. Out to McLean. McLean from uh, about the foul line, no good. Rebound number 24 over Ferguson and over Shelton, no good. Shelton back to cleans the rebound. Kicks it out to Hensley. Hensley up court quickly for Gate City. Gonna drive. Kicks it out to Ferguson, open. Ferguson, and he traveled with it, indecisive about whether to drive or shoot. Gets caught with a traveling violation. Gate City still up by seven, but Volunteer will be inbounding to number 20, Duthot. Joe Duthot has been an excellent point guard for Volunteer tonight. Good patience on the offense and great defense. Looking inside, Volunteer can't get anything to McLean. McLean being guarded by Shelton. Spins, trying to get around Shelton. No good. Let's see what the call will be. It will be a foul on Shelton. Chris Shelton has picked up foul number... Foul number two, I believe. to call it and Shelton has the shot up and good as that was number 30 McLean over Shelton. The volunteer has once again put within six. Morris passing over to Ferguson. Ferguson looking inside trying to find Shelton. Shelton and number 32 Byington finding it out in there. 
Morris going to drive over McLean. Shot wild. No good. Pendleton rebound. Puts it up underneath. Good. Rusty Pendleton has put some key points in the basket for Gate City. Again, Gate City up by seven. Has